presenting the adventures of Jungle Jim. Last week, Jungle Jim and Kolo reached the Chalmers camp and found Lynn unconscious from a bullet wound, and her father gone. Quickly, they started out to look for the missionary. Meanwhile, the Reverend, as a prisoner of Mamba, is taken before the vampire Batwoman. He recognized her as Lily DeVril, or Shanghai Lil, as she was better known, a woman he had once tried to reform. The thrilling adventures of Jungle Jim are pictured each Sunday in the Comic Weekly, the world's greatest pictorial supplement of humor and adventure. The Comic Weekly, each page printed in full colors, is distributed everywhere as an integral part of your Hearst Sunday newspaper. And now we continue the story. With his hands still tied behind him, the Reverend Chalmers stands in front of the bamboo table in the great hall of the plantation house. Behind it, his captors, the vampire Batwoman, Jacques Lebas and Mamba, face him. The Batwoman is speaking. I'm glad to see you, Reverend Chalmers. I'm sure you'll forgive me if I say I don't believe you. You're wrong. I hate you, Dr. Chalmers, but I'm glad to see you. This is the moment I've dreamed about, thought about, planned for some years. Ten of them were in that prison you had me sent to. Yes, I had you arrested because you killed a man in jealous rage. What? You kill a man, boss? My God. After all, my efforts to reforming you had failed, Lily DeVille. Your efforts to reform me, Dr. Chalmers. Would singing hymns and praying have changed the condition under which I was forced to live? Not very much. What do you do about making my life any easier? Nothing. I had first to change your outlook on life. Well, you changed that all right. While I was listening to you, the men I... The men I loved turned to somebody else. But you didn't care about that. You didn't even try to find out why I killed him. You killed him in jealous rage. That's what you think. That's what you made the judge and jury think. And that was enough for you. Well, that's all past changing now. I've served my time. I've paid society ten years of my life for that worthless rotter. And now you've got another life to pay for, Shanghai Lil. My daughters. What do you mean? This black cutthroat of yours... Oh, tongue belong you. Shut up, Mamba. Go on, Reverend. What about your daughter? This black cutthroat of yours shot her, knocked me senseless and dragged me away, leaving my daughter dying, or for all we know, already dead. Let's hope she is dead. It'll be less trouble all around. If Lynn is dead, the little real... You'll be punished for it. You seem to forget you're in the jungle country, Reverend. There's no law here but what we make ourselves. There's a divine law that says thou shalt not kill. You may not stand trial here, but you'll be tried by the great judge in the hereafter. If there is a hereafter, that's something that you can't prove, Reverend Chalmers. The Bible tells us... Tells us? But that doesn't prove it. You never were able to prove all that stuff you told me when you tried to reform me. That's why you failed, if you want to know. Have you no faith, little of real? I've got plenty. In what? In things that have proved worth having faith in. What, for instance? Well, my gun. Oh, your gun. It's never jammed or failed me when I've needed it. And in Laba and Mamba here, they've never failed me when I've trusted them to obey my orders. My God, Shaki Laba, loyal to you, boss. Mamba do like you tell me, see? I know that, boy. Why? Why don't you give the scriptures a chance? I did once, and no. that was enough. You didn't really give them a chance, not really. Why don't you try now, again? It's not too late, even now. Listen to him, Papa. I hear he was trying for to make you repent for what you do, huh? I've got to hand it to you, Dr. Chalmers. Here you stand at my mercy, and you have a nerve enough to try to reform me all over again. The Lord bids me fight the good fight in his name. Some victories are harder than others. But I must press on the fight as long as we both shall live. Ah, that missionary talk too much, boss. Why you no let me reform him? Maybe gentler Jacques Laba make him do little repenting for what he do to you, boss. Laba is right. You're talking too much. Why I stand here and listen to you, I don't know. I swore I'd have my revenge for what you did to me, and by heaven, I will. That's the way to speak up, boss. I'm going to make you crawl. Do you hear me, you oily-tongued hymn singer? I'm going to make you crawl at the feet of Shanghai Lil. At that moment, Jungle Jim, Lynn Chalmers, and Kolo stand rooted to the ground by a blood-curdling scream. What's that, Jim? Mm, sounds like a puma. A female puma whose little one is lost. I've only met one in that state once before, and I might say we're in a tough spot. 
I didn't think the animals bothered you in the daytime. Well, Mrs. Puma doesn't stop for conventions or formalities when her baby has disappeared. Colo, push ahead to the first clear place you see. All right, Juan Jim. Oh, what are we going to do, Jim? Well, I don't want Mrs. Puma to drop down on us from one of those trees unexpectedly. It'll be healthier if there's plenty of room around us. Oh, Jim. Oh, Jim. Oh, now, don't worry, Lynn. We'll get past them somehow. Colo, do you see an open place ahead there? Yes, it's one. Plenty soon. Good. Now, you stick right close to me, Lynn. You think I won't? I'm going to be like your shadow. One, Jim. Huh? What is it, Colo? Animal in open place. What? Two animals walk round and round. One look into eyes belong other. Good. What's good about it, Jim? Why, there's going to be a fight. That means there'll only be one of them left to bother us, if there is one left. And after the fight, we'll be plenty tired. Oh, have we got to stay here while they fight? Oh, we must get along and find Father. We can't waste time like this. Lynn, this being your first trip down here excuses a remark like that. Why? Well, you see, the wind is blowing towards us at the present. Now, if we try to get around the cat, the wind would blow our scent to them, and like as not, both would turn on us. Oh, I see. Now, Lynn, follow me carefully. Colo, you stay in the back with the luggage. Yes, it's one. We're sticking here until this thing is settled. <laughs> Back at the plantation house, Shanghai Lil disposes of her prisoner. La bra. Oui, boss. Take the reverend to our guest house. Ah, ha, 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 the guest house. That one good joke, boss. Take the reverend to our guest house. Why can't I do that? Come along, Padre. Mamba, you go get ready for our guest. <laughs> All right, Mamba, go. Make yourself as comfortable as you can, Dr. Talmers. The Lord is my comfort and my salvation. <laughs> You'll need plenty where you're going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what that boss woman? She's one clever woman, Padre. Is she? You'll find out, by God. Nobody ever put anything over on her. Or me. Yes, Laba. Really? I say, Laba, whereabouts are we? This place, I mean. What you care? You know, going to send picture postcard. Ha, 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 ha. how long have you been with Lily DeVille? Well, I've been with her for... Say, hey, you have too many questions, Padre. Here we are, the guest house. This hut? On the list, neat, this hut, Padre. Open the door, Mamba. Go on in. Lift up that door, Mamba. Now, Padre, get down those stairs. Well, I suppose there's nothing to do but to obey. You'll be plenty warm, Padre, but there's one window down there. By God, I hope you like the view. Lock the door, Mamba. I go back now, see boss. Mamba, do. dungeon like you say. Good. Now, before he finds out why we're here, I want you to break him. Laba, tend to that for you, boss. By God, you lead everything to Jacques Laba. What are you sharpening your knife for? I don't want you to kill him yet. All right, boss. Just like you say. But I get the knife ready just the same. At last, I've got Chalmers in my power. This is marvelous. We oui, boss. Oh, you knew how I'd planned this, Labar. Every minute I was in that prison, I thought about getting revenge when I was freed. Uh, Labar, no, boss. I go to prison too a couple times. When I get out, I get even with somebody too. They know here to tell about it. Yes, I understand. But before I let you finish him off, I want you to make the Reverend Manley Calmers wish he was dead. Put me in prison, will he? Reform me, Willie. <laughs> I'll teach him. Boss, for one so beautiful as you, Jacques Labar, do anything. We anything. jungle clearing, the two wild cats are at it tooth and claw. 
Wow. Look at that fume of snap, will you? I, I'm terribly frightened, Jim. I wish they'd stop and go away so we can hurry after Dad. Oh, I'm sorry, Lynn, but we can't budge from this spot until one or both of these animals is killed. Look, look. One animal hurt bad now, Swan. Yes? That was in the death grapple, all right. Not until one or the other gets killed. Look, look. Animals died, one thing. Yes, sir. It won't be long now. Just about one more lunge and... What'd I tell you? See? The victor is making sure he's made a good job of it. And here's the moment I've been waiting for. You're going to shoot him? I'm going to do my darndest. Just let me get a bead on that lad. Jump up in air. Drop down. No more move, son. Yes, Colo, I think I got him. Oh, Jim, with one shot. Oh, you're marvelous. Well, I had to make that shot, Count Lynn. That boy had a taste of blood, and he was fighting mad, remember? Come on now. Let's hit the trail again. Oh, let's hurry. I hope nothing else prevents us from catching up to Dad. Meanwhile, back at the plantation house, Shanghai Lil is interested in the throbbing drums. Baba. Baba, where are you? Baba, here, boss. We've got some news. Come here. News? Wait, girl, what news we got, boss? Huh? That jungle Jim, she not dead. No, worse luck, but it's a bad jungle, Jim. We, boss? He and his native boy are on their way up here. My God, that good. I want for to see that fellow. And they got Talma's daughter with him. What? Mamba's aim wasn't so good. Padre know this, boss? You think I'm a fool? What he doesn't know will hurt him. I want him to brood over the fate of that brat of his until he goes mad. He going for to have plenty of time to do that before he come out of the guest house. Those drums are sending orders to my scouts along the trail. If any of them catch sight of Jungle Jim and his companions, they have been told what to do. What further adventures are in store for Jungle Jim and Lynn Chalmers before they reach the plantation where Shanghai Lil is holding the missionary prisoner? What devilish plan has the Batwoman devised to talk to the Reverend Chalmers before aid can reach him? In the Comic Weekly next Sunday, you will find in full-color action pictures many of the scenes portrayed in today's dramatization. And you will also find many other famous characters of the world of pictures. In addition to Jungle Jim, there is Slips and Casper, Barney Google, The Little King, Cats and Jammer Kids, Flash Gordon, and many, many others. There is also a new group of colored poster stamps to add to your collection. Those wonderful large-sized colored picture stamps showing many famous scenes and historic people. And don't forget our date at the same time next week for a continuation of the adventures of Jungle Jim. Jungle Jim.